What's going on guys? So let's switch back over to the Heritage because when I bought the bike, I ordered the stock Harley backrest. And although I am not impressed with it, uh, pad slides I look down out of the way. A lot of people probably complained it. No matter how tight I make the sucker on the back, it's either gonna pull the screws through the padding backing or it's gonna slide down as you use it. But I'm researching different options, so we'll figure that out later. But when I ordered it, I also ordered the luggage rack to go on the back and it finally came in. So comes in all packaged up in a box like this. I'm gonna open it up, take it out, and do a short video on how to attach it to the back of the backrest and see what it looks like, how it lays over my plate. And then we'll use that for a while until we find a better solution. So be right back in a couple minutes. I'm gonna reposition the camera, get it over a table, and kind of show you what it looks like when it's all opened up. Cool, back in a minute. Okay, so I got it all opened up. Comes with the luggage rack, uh, exploded view, of instructions from Harley, two clamps that go onto the back of the bar, various hardware, nylon nuts, bolts, washers, and such. And it attaches back here to the back of this area and comes in. So pretty much should be a simple install. We'll see how it goes. I'm gonna pull the backrest off here and just to show you how that works in case you don't know. When it snaps into your mounting hardware, just pull back on the little levers and pull it off and it sits right there. But I'm going to lay this down so it looks like that. So let me grab the tools that I need and we'll get uh, set up and drop it down a little different angle and uh, get started mounting this thing, see how it goes. Okay, so I got everything laid out, tools you're going to need, 7 16 wrench, of course, you know, I like my little spindle wrench, as you guys know, quarter drive socket or a ratchet. I just have a little extension to get me away from stuff and a T25 Torx bit. I put Loctite on these bolts. These have nylon nuts, but uh, I put them on anyway, just in case. These smaller ones thread into this area here, which is a pre-threaded spot on the back of the backrest. So. That's okay. And then I kind of kind of got it oriented to where I think it's going to go. It's going to take a little maneuverability. So I'm going to start by putting in these small little screws here so that it holds it in place while I'm trying to get everything together. So I think that'll help. I don't know if it'll work out right or not, but we'll give it a shot. So we stick these little guys in here, find the hole. That one started. Shiny side up on the washer. Hopefully they're threaded right. Oops. Slippery little sucker. Come on. Okay, so now that that's in there, I'm gonna run these down a little bit just so it doesn't fall off on me. I'm trying to do stuff, but I'm not gonna tighten them all the way. I'm just gonna run them down so that it holds it in there. So that one in there, okay. Okay, so still movable but it's not gonna go anywhere. So let me pull this a little closer now. See if this helps the visibility. All right, so I got those two in there and based on the instructions, these are side specific. So they go around the back, hook into here and then Three bolts, nuts, washers on this side, three bolts, nuts, nuts, washers on that side, and they secure in, okay? So, I will start with the two upper ones. 
on this side. Okay, so now she's all mounted. Okay, so two bolts here, one bolt here, side bolt there, same on both sides. And we'll adjust this over and see how it looks on the bike. Okay, so as I mentioned before, there's two mounting points here where these go on, so this Slides in there like that, pushes forward all the way down, and it comes down and latches on. So there we have the new luggage rack. There was a sticker back here that said max load 110 pounds, but I don't like stickers all over my bike, so took that off. But at least it completes it, so We'll see how it works. And uh, it's Harley. But like I said, this part sucks. This whole backing, this pad slides down. See, when you're riding. And no matter how tight I make it, it still does it. So, probably look at a different solution. There's a lot of them out there. But anyway, there you have it. Backrest installed on stock Harley uh, backrest seat and, and the luggage rack installed, sorry. And so if you need to do it, that's how easy it is. All right, like, subscribe, put your comments in, appreciate any feedback. Take care, see you in the next one.